Hi guys, welcome back to another anyway, video. Today this is pretty much um, story time, episode six, and um, I might do an episode seven if Lucas plugs his mic in. But this is going to be another one of my stories, except it's going to be horror. So if you hate clowns, leave right now. Sure. There was one half of no all my, of your all of your subscribers. Mom. No, 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 no. Okay, so, okay, so I was, I was just, wait, there was this young boy, oh yes, yeah, your mic is working, okay, there was once this young boy called Lucas, aka ZXL Cosmic, go check him out on YouTube, Lucas, and he was, and he, he was just skipping along the road, and all of a sudden, he dropped his, no, then he skipping. skipping along the road, and then all of a sudden, he dropped his boat down the stream. He brought his what down the stream? And then all of a sudden, oh no, Pennywise is about to come out. <laughs> Stephen, <laughs> Stephen, just so you know, um, build, keep building up. No, just do it one block one. Okay, and then all of a sudden, what happened was there was just a weird thing happened. He went down the drain, and he wasn't too bothered by it. And then, so he just turned round to go home because he thought that was enough, considering he just lost his boat. But no, because when he, because then all of a sudden there was a voice behind him. He turned round, nothing. He heard it again, but he heard it from the sewer. So he went over to look, nothing. And then when he kept on peering into the darkness, and then in a split second. A face appeared from the sewers. A clown, it looked. And so, as he was tormented by this sight, he he asked. He decided to very nervously ask for his boat back. And then, all of a sudden, the clown said, "Yes, sure, son." But then, strangely enough, instead, what happened was he gave the boat back. And gave him a little gift with it, a red balloon. Oh, oh no! Oh and no! As no, he no. Gave, as he gave I know him, that. <laughs> and he gave him the red <laughs> balloon and told him that good things will come when you hold it. And oh, so sure. he went to school that day, skipping along like he was the day before, with his balloon. You can skipping, imagine. <laughs> yeah, imagine and you so, Skipping. Lucas, you know, doing exercises, skip, that's impossible. Anyway, um, so he was oh! skipping along at school and all of a sudden he was thinking to himself, what, does this red balloon really give me good luck? And, and as soon side. as that happened... Yeah, Stephen, I dipped this side. Wait, which question one's the occurred. next biggest? No, and Stephen, this one's mine because it's the biggest. Can you stop it's shouting? Or maybe we can mute Charlie. Sorry. No, I have a lot. Oh. Lucas, I have hyperactiveness. I know, but you could please be quiet. <laughs> okay, so basically, as he, his answer to this lucky balloon was found out shortly enough. As men... That day, really good things were happening, but one thing was for sure, it wasn't safe. Because as he was holding his balloon, whenever he let go, bad luck Shh. happened. And Pennywise, the clown in the sewer, knew this, which means that when he, the boy went to sleep, bad luck Does no was one happening. know where I am? Oh, so, no. and he had not told him this. I'm so, in a coat. he went over to bed, let go, and then the face from the sewer appeared in the shadows under his bed. Smiling, doing his weird little grin with a big, with a red balloon, whispering, okay. want another balloon? Came out from under the bed. And all of a sudden, he grabbed the knife and went right through his heart. No, don't kick him. Don't kick him. Just and now him. that he was dead, Pennywise had nothing left to do than devour his soul and shape shift into into Lucas. And considering Lucas was a bit of an alien, he had troubles doing this, but eventually managed it. 
Oh, come on, Tom. Tom, <laughs> no, I'm, you're, you're actually roasting me. Stop. Stop. But once oh, wait, no. Once you should name this. You should name this video. Um, read this to your five-year-old for bedtime story. Oh gosh, no. <laughs> okay. Anyway. Um. Oh gosh, <laughs> Um. Yeah, as he was, as he was, once he'd shape shifted, he scrambled into bed, and then clutched the balloon tight as if it meant the world to him. The whole night he didn't let go of the balloon. But as it, Tom, but you as it, I have. But as it hit, as it hit midnight, it, the balloon inside started glowing. Strangely enough, um, Jack Lucas's brother walked into his bedroom to check on him and noticed the balloon instantly. And whilst noticing this strange occurrence. He noticed Just a question, do you know what my brother's name is? Uh, Joshua. Good. Well, Josh. Um, yeah, he's Joshua. Uh, yeah. Um, anyway, um, as he hello. did, his brother... Hello, I'm doing my Hi. story time. I'm doing a horror one, so be quiet. Um, <laughs> so... Yeah, I did, like, as... I did, like, my seventh story time. Okay, so, yeah, as as the clown approached... As, no, sorry. As, um... As um, Joshua, Lucas's brother, uh, approached Lucas's bed, yeah, he noticed the balloon instantly and noticed this was not normal. He decided to gently wake Lucas up and asked, Where did you get that balloon? And Lucas replied with a smile. Like before, when he had devoured Lucas and become Lucas, he opened his mouth, normal teeth turned to razors, and bit him. After oh, doing this, mm -hmm. he decided that he would have to call the police to arrest his parents and blame them with the murder. Being the clown he was, he no. made some little jokes like oh, writing, like writing, I'd rather be you, dead no, than alive drive. in their blood. And did some nasty little tricks. Lucas and Josh, Joshua, both being dead. Pennywise thought, let's go back down to the sewers. And so he, he galloped along like I a horse. He galloped along like a horse over to, uh, oh, <laughs> um, and once he did that, he got he went over to the sewer, and there, strangely enough, was another person who had dropped one of their teddies into the uh, sewer. And he went over, went slipped into the sewer without him noticing, and then appeared again. But this time, oh, one sec, hold up, wait a minute. I'll continue this story when she's gone, but for now, watch this epic fighting. Subscribe and like. What the hell is happening right for now? For more content. Story time. Yeah. Story time. That's what we're doing. Story time. Yeah, I'm doing mine. Look, this is where you spawn. No, this is the smallest one. Can you, uh, can I... I thought um, you were the biggest one. This is the wait, biggest one. I need to go into um, Charlie's... Can I... This is the biggest one. <laughs> Can I have a island edit? Story time is no, back on. Okay, so <laughs> where did I? Okay, I and once he went back in, instead he asked the little boy to go to follow him into the sewer, and so he did without thinking. Yeah. But yeah. to be fair, he was quite young, so he did. And then as they were going through the sewer, he How thought, old is "Wow." This boy exactly? Yeah, what? I'm gonna show you. Um, I would say about six, seven, eight. And so we can go street think. on his own. Yeah. 
And so he didn't really think of anything about it being a killer clown, so he followed him relentlessly. And and so whilst he was doing this, he um he followed him through the sewer and saw blood marks. He told he told um Pennywise about this, but Pennywise just ignored him and if he was to answer, he had to he had an answer in his mind. It's just it's just um, strawberry sauce for an ice cream I had. I'm very messy. And then he started to notice some things wrapped up in bandages hanging from the walls. And as he got closer, without Pennywise knowing, he took away a bandage and saw his mum and dad's faces, who went missing. What? A month okay. ago. Okay. This really is a five-year-old's bedtime story. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> My brother would absolutely love this. Me yeah, show this to your brother. Killed. Show this to your brother. Um, yeah. My brother's dead. Also, yeah. <laughs> and since I've been missing for one month, he had had to do stuff by himself, but thankfully his family was quite rich, so he had enough money to fend for himself food-wise. <gasps> Get clapped. Um, oh. and, <laughs> and as he was doing this, um, he kept on... As soon as he saw a red balloon in the corner, he thought to himself, I keep on seeing this red balloon, because he'd seen it every single time he went to the shop every single time he went to bed in his dreams and always with that balloon was this very same clown so also but in his dreams what yeah, dude. you mean in his and nightmares so, yeah and so all of a sudden he dreams. thought that he knew something bad was going to happen so he ran out box like a fish um, he he ran out without Pennywise knowing, running for his life, fearing that something bad, in other words, death might occur. <laughs> in other so, words, death it might yeah, occur. Yeah, in other words, death it might occur. And so, as he was doing this, he was running, he was running. Crazy. Now, all of a sudden, something squishy and soft Ooh, hit well, him in well, the well, head. <laughs> he looked uh, round and it turned out something to be another, cla another clown's stomach. And so he then slowly oh. looked up, and there he was, a clown with half a head missing, an arm missing, and oh a God. chainsaw in his hand, holding it high my above his God. head. Oh, and with that strike, arm. his life ended. My God. And What's happening to me right now? Um, you're dead. <laughs> you died a while ago. No one cares if you Wait, did or not, Charlie. Oh yeah, and then this this peculiar thing kept on happening until Pennywise like, and the fat clown did, were the last bad. ones alive in the world. Ah, yeah, yeah. Okay, <laughs> and so, yeah, that's my story. Um, I <laughs> hope you enjoyed. And I'll see well, the five -year -olds you on enjoy it for yeah. bedtime. And I'll see you on the next one. Which will be